Hey everyone, we're here with tonight's item shop video. So we got the Shadow Strike pack starting with the their own little featured area over here. We got Shadow Arch type with the dark paradigm back bling. So this skin in general is pretty rare. He I think he did come back a couple of times, but not not too often. The Night Gunner with the Night Bag. Now he always comes back whenever the Bright Bomber comes back, so he's he's kind of more common. The Mecha Team Shadow with the Shadow Jet Set. Now this one, mm -hmm. well no, it did come back the other day with like a new glider, but this one's just a different color and it's in a different set. But yeah, I guess I, the rarest one's probably Arch Type, honestly. But separately over here, you get the Shadow Combo Cleavers along with the Shadow Caliper Pickaxe. And I'm guessing there's no third one because the, the Night Gunner doesn't have another one, I'm pretty sure. But if you like the Shadow Series stuff, I still haven't purchased, I, I haven't really used my V-Bucks for it yet because it kind of is expensive, but I'll see. Because I am collecting all the series. If you guys collect Shadow Series, this will be the time for you. These things always come back, you know, bundles, anything in general. We got the Monk skin with the peel pack and they each get their own little new styles which i personally love it looks really good this is like honestly a, wi a winter type skin you could use if you really want to flex during the winter c zone we have focus with the chuck pack so she comes back once in a while not too rare it looks like she wore her mask a little too high but i don't know yeah i can see how, how it kind of is weird to people kind of is you can't even see her face at all okay i knew it was coming you know the fixation this one used to be rare it always comes back now with her so at least people could have a chance to get it we have abstract with his secondary style which looks a lot better in my opinion i think he he even has a little secret here i think it's the shadow logo yeah because the ghost is that other one and the tag bag which doesn't get any new edit styles the Renegade Roller, still no Raider. I don't know where, where she's hiding at. But uh, this is a cool pickaxe. I know we had a double pickaxe of this in a battle pass. But uh, this one's really cool, honestly. I feel like you can get good use out of it. We have the Sun Soldiers Bundle. So I'll preview this here. We take off the hat or a little, I don't know what you want to call it, head, headdress? I don't know. We get the purple and blue style, which I love the most. It honestly looks really good with them. We have the Sun Wings, which come in purple, of course, to match your secondary styles. The Sunrise Glider. The Mesmer, with his purple and blue style. And also the Hypnotic Back Bling, with same style to match. And the Aztec Pickaxe. So, pretty cool set. I think it still holds up. Uh, I, I really like it when they come out with the locker bundles and all these little bundles because sometimes it's cheap For me, it's not but I'm you know, you just got to hope maybe one day someone's gonna do a locker bundle and this skin's in it But uh, you never know we got glum bunny hanging out on the side here. Not sure why she's there, but Still a great skin. I think it's very unique uh, Lots of stuffed animals along her Yeah, honestly wearing a better skin. She doesn't really come back too often. I mean well, that's probably a lie. I think I remember her in one of my videos. Wow, this is a long featured. Uh, probably because the shadow. I think this is throwing me off. Because it looks like it's going on forever. But we got the zero skin with the black hole back bling. Everybody remembers uh, what that's referenced to. But uh, pretty pricey for the skin, honestly. Really, really pricey. But I feel like it could be some kind of use. I don't know. It's not one of my favorites. But because the zero point wrap, of course, it's animated. We got the crystal skin. The non-summer version, at least. I know she has another version. Oh, yeah, she has the summer version and she has the per permafrost. Because I know she has, like, an ice style. So, I didn't mean a couple of her. We got the Bronto with the Bronto bag. So, basically copying what the backlings do. And I do like how they do that. They make the backling with the head cut off so that it looks like the hat you're wearing connects with the backling. So I like to do that with the dinosaur skins. We have Pterodactyl. Nice little robotic 
pterodactyl here. It looks really good. It starts off with an egg. So, very unique with that. We got the bite mark. Very comedic, but I'm sure it could go to some use. I don't know. I don't know if any of the dinosaurs are this color. But I'm sure that, yeah, there's probably some use with it. I'm sure someone will find out. We have the waypoint making her return. You can have all her uh, head stuff off. The hat, the, what do you want to call it, a headset. Looks like a bandit mask all over her. So you can take all that off. You just like the plain style. And you can also change your color around. You could take a little a new style to the set. I honestly, I personally like this style more. I mean, I do like the blue, don't get me wrong. But, uh, yeah, I like it without that all the stuff on, too. Like, it just really, it looks like a good skin. I hope people don't pass it up. We got the signal hub, which is reactive. I'm not sure what it's reacted to. Maybe, oh, it says, changes color based on damage dealt to opponents. So, apparently, that's what it is. We have the Moisty Merman, a fan favorite. Well... At least he should be. He is for two thousand. This is a great deal. All these styles. You know, he used to just have one, but since they made more, he's a lot more worth it. He got the Mer Tank back bling. I'm not sure if that's like cheese or what. Maybe like glue, some type of glue. But uh, definitely a cool skin. I would call it. I, I call it like halfway meme because you could see somebody in it. I call it like a halfway meme skin. But that's all I'll do. The studded axe, which is still glitched because it's not supposed to be. This kind of, I don't know what to call it, like chrome. It has like a weird shine to it. I don't know. It looks like the texture is just off or something. I don't know what's wrong with it. We have a llama cadabra. Now that's that's a rare emote. That one I know for sure because I watch people's videos on YouTube and this is one of the emotes that popped out. I think these went with the the wizard skins, the magic female and the magic male. I think they came out a couple days ago. Not new, but they're still great skins if you guys saw my item shop with them. So, pretty cool emote. We got Sasquatching, which is traversal for 200. So, might as well get it, especially if you got Bigfoot back when uh, he came back. Or was it Sasquatch? Did it call him Sasquatch? I don't remember. But, uh, still a great skin if you got him. We got Blinding Lights. Nice little icon series emote there. So, honestly, nice. We got a rare emote. Guys of Thunderpack, Captain America, Grand Salute. The food stuff. Oh, they put it all in one single line. That's that's pretty good. That's convenient. I'm still debating, guys. I don't know. I really don't know if I'm going to get this. It's a, it's a maybe in my books. And we got levels, and we got the crew. So, rare emote maybe rare skin i don't know i don't think there's any rare skins yeah just just rare emo i'll say but other than that hopefully you guys did enjoy this video and as always i shall see you guys tomorrow